So I got my start in franchise and I quit law school. I uh, went to orientation and I said, forget it. I don't want to be an attorney. I started up a lawn company and I was doing lawn work for this older lady. And she said, Eric, what do you want to do when you grow up? And I said, I want to be a real estate investor because I was taking real estate classes at the time. And she said, oh, we did that 20 years ago. I said, well, tell me more. She said, well, we bought a condo down by the beach and we did it for tax purposes back then. And now we just want to sell it. I said, well, what do you mean you want to sell it? Remember, I have no money at this time. I'm planting grass. And she said, we did it for tax purposes and, and we want to sell it. I said, well, I'll buy it. How much do you want for it? And she said, just take over the payments. So well, what do you mean just take over the payment? She said, just take over the payment. I said, let me see your mortgage documents. I said, assumable mortgage. And I was smart enough to recognize that I could just assume that mortgage. They don't do that anymore. 20 year old mortgage. She's been paying on it for 20 years. Long story short, I'm able to assume that mortgage and I sell that house within months. I make my first large sum of money, larger than I've ever made in my entire life combined up until that point. I didn't squander it. I took that pile of cash. I put that into my first franchise that I bought. And I grew that into multiple units over the course of nine years. I sold it after 12 units of, of retail. And I took a master franchise, a regional development from four stores to 42 stores and sold that back to the corporate office. I started helping people like you. I started, I sold franchises in the middle of that. I focused on building my management, my teams, and I sold all of it and used that money, my exit strategy, to buy more businesses. And so that's why I have three different franchises now, multiple brands, all in Southern California, all semi-absentee. I spend five hours a week on these companies because they're all run by great managers.